Welcome to the month forecast. Okay, but before we start, uh, anything else you guys want to ask? Uh, basically, I'm treating this like a YouTube recording because I want to um, I want to upload it later on. This is what I do, yeah. No ideas of content creation, just put something up there and hope that somebody see that. <laughs> Hi, Ivy. Anybody got anything specifically? Uh, normally, I should not do that. Okay. Um, let me share the, the stuff first. Um, I think a lot of people consider about all these disasters happening. Can we have uh, things happening? No. Same thing. Flood. Flood. It's not flood. Maybe it's flood. Okay. It's all happening. Uh, if you look into Mother Earth Oracles, it was meant to be um, autumn season for all year long. Autumn season for all year long means that, is it autumn? No, no, no. Uh, win is it winter? I think it's autumn season. Is it called autumn? Yeah. Supposed to be autumn season. Uh, is it autumn? I think it's a snowing season all year long. It's a winter season all year long. Um, in the Mother of Records, it's something like that, yeah? Mary saying floating in your area, huge floating. Yeah. We are actually moving into a month where this particular year, I would say that most of the time we will have Kung Metal uh, always meet with surging snake. So this one is a high indications of natural disaster. Um, normal way of reading, eh? Normal way of reading. So gui water and also rainwater is a high indications of water related problem. So most likely it's flooding. Uh, if you look even further, this is star five. <clears throat> most likely is uh, it will not be too disastrous because seven is the highest, six is the second highest, five is actually quite dominant. So uh, one is totally like not that kind of a disaster. Okay, so when you look at it, you already know that. Okay, it was still ongoing. Okay, ongoing. Uh, what area affected maybe is of the place, but uh, most likely come from forest, foresty area, because it represent uh, Zheng Gua. Okay, so uh, because somebody just asked me about disaster in my business group, I just tell the the person uh, I think Shirley, I just tell Shirley that mm, it's keep on going. Uh, most likely, according to chart calculations, uh, it will still going to be continuously because this thing is ongoing. Okay. Especially this particular year, we have the natural disaster sign from uh, Jia and the uh, Chen, Wood Dragon, yeah, is still like that. Okay. So there's a bunch of disaster. Okay. We have to late start in winter. They predict it will extend to into spring this year. I live in South Africa. We didn't get earthquakes, but have two minor earthquakes which run the east, uh, in the past month. Yeah, so we're actually moving into that. So um, it's, a, it's a big sign. I think this year, the surging snake also in the north. Uh, yeah, somehow it just keep on going. Okay, it's a, it's a full it's a year full of natural disaster. It's supposed to be in that way. <clears throat> okay, supposed to be in that way because of the wood dragon is the big uh the biggest indications of disaster. Okay, in sixty pillar sixty pillar of uh combinations of stem and branches, most likely that is uh the things uh and even mother earth oracles in uh. So many different types of oracles also indicates that it is a huge change uh, of stuff is happening. So we are now in the middle of the year. Okay. So uh, when is it the peak of this thing is actually happening? Um, supposed to be, it's either dragon month or the dog month. 
Okay, the, the worst thing that can actually happen. So in Dragon Man, we already have the volcano erupted that somehow keep on coming back. Uh, Taiwan, the earthquake is still ongoing because Taiwan is quite famous with uh, aftershock. Okay, so um, based on what already happened in the beginning of the years, most likely it will also end in that way. Most likely, yeah. Okay, so if you are in that, in that kind of area, you have to be prepared. Um, how do we prepare with this kind of uh, situations? Uh, normally, um, since that is uh, the, the things keep on repeating, okay, I think it's way better that you prepare not to be overly, um, you know, settle down in whatever the situations you are. Try to be prepared for more things that happen, uh, unless this year, okay? At least this particular year, the entire month, after you finish it, uh, finish this particular year until moving to next year, uh, it will be way better. Okay. Hi, Simon. Uh, okay. Uh, what else I actually have to be aware? Um, this is also the period nine, uh, the starting point of period, period nine years. Um, it's a post. Uh, it's, it's actually add on another layer to say that uh, transition timing actually also caused a lot of reset happening. It's only reset that is happening uh, before you can settle down and start to move onwards. Um, in this half year, what should you actually need to focus on? What you should really need to focus on? Um, normally, uh, in period nine, actually not much of people actually go through certain period of changes. Not much of people actually go through that. Um, maybe you met some master, but maybe the master only uh, proficiency in certain type of uh, school. Uh, and it's very, very hard to confirm that all these things is, um, how to say, really give you a proof that it's going to be like that. It's very hard. So what we actually do, we just observe the energy flow. Yeah, observe the energy flow. So then transitions timing is always the lowest point of energies. Everything unstable. If it's clash, it just come out. Okay. So when you move forward, um, that's why it will say that after the transitions, energy will start to build back up. So after this year, you will see energy start to build up. So in this half of the half of the year, uh, it was meant for you guys to really like going into understanding yourself then what you should start building. This will be the right timing to do so. Yeah, it's always like that. Yeah? Because beginning of the uh, uh, period nine, uh, the transition timing is start to build up. That means that whatever that you create now, if it is aligned with the energy flow, we're talking about energy flow, if it's aligned with the energy flow, the energy will slowly comes to you and inject into whatever that you're actually doing, and then it will start slowly moving upwards. Okay, so start something in this timing. Very, very good, yeah? Start to me in the timing. Yeah? So in the middle of the year, it's like revelation is what we need to do. It's not middle of the year. It's like this particular timing of period nine. This is a, if you haven't really have something on your hands that you're thinking about, you should become a superwoman. You should become, a, you know, some thought leaders or want to become who you really are. Yeah, and what kind of business you want to go in. Um, this half of the year is a time to build that up. So if you have anything, take a small risk, since that everything is chaos right now, uh, take a small risk and try to build up your path for the coming uh, period night. A very short advice to you, but it's a very powerful uh, things to do in this middle of the year, this middle of the year, right now. Okay, it's very good. We are not looking into the chart. We are now looking into what comes with the period energies because everywhere is chaos. Yeah, and in the early of this half year, most likely you already know uh, what you should go into because problem appear um, and solution were actually given to you and you actually created the solution for certain people and that is a path that you are meant to fall into uh, for the next maybe six to seven years for growth. Normally look into period, yeah? Normally look into period, is, that is the thing that's happening. So you will be given the tools and stuff like that 
in what happens in the past half year. And that tools is something that you need to build this uh, after this, after the after this half years that's coming ahead of you. Okay, and to build up the ne next coming uh, seven years. Uh, most likely when I say like this is for someone who really want to maybe get rich in this moment of time. Okay, nobody doesn't want to get rich, right? So try to reflect back what happened in the past half year and see what is it that you are do you actually do very well in, very well worth in, or certain new things comes to you. Actually, not just past half years, yeah. It's a past few years because in a transition timing, that is where the uh the new things comes to you. And if you ignore that, most of the time you miss out that opportunity. Okay? Most of the time you uh, miss out the opportunities, yeah? And especially these few weeks, there will be somebody comes to advise you. Yeah? If you have somebody come and advise you, it's trying to tell you it's time to start it off. Yeah? Then somebody just tell you that your talent is wasted. In this particular, it's just three weeks, yeah? Yeah? Yeah, so have somebody come to advise, right? Normally, this is what happened. And it's tell you that it's time to do something. Okay, yeah. So that's why you have to know that uh, the signals is already happening. Means that the next half year, you no matter how, you should take some risks to go to do something big. Take some risks to do something big. Yeah, then you will see in period nine, maybe it's actually an alignment to you to go into. Because changing of period is, that is the biggest indication. It's very hard to tell you directly, you know, uh, what you should go into. Yeah, we all have all these metaphysics indications of element to you. But somehow, your universe or your own higher intelligence is giving you directions. So you really need to look back what happened in this past half year, yeah. Especially these few months that somebody come and advise you, you should take it. That's means it's a sign. Okay? Yeah? Now, so, um, this is going to be next month. Okay? First of all, let's look into the path chart. Correct? So, when you look into the path chart this particular uh, month, we're transitioning going into the goat month. Okay? And you look into this goat, um, it's just too many of earth element appearing and the sink metal seems like how to say it's being suppressed, it's being buried okay, buried underground uh, because the earth element is too much so it will cause a lot of rusty thing is happening in here okay, and <clears throat> of course this is not really good in terms of uh human relations with their confidence, their ability in controlling uh, wealth, uh, facing with circumstances, actually not very good in that terms. Um, but IR is very high, actually indicates, also indicates a uh, strong day master. Okay? It also indicates strong day master, but this is not a very strong uh, day master. Uh, the reason is because it's not rooted and the god um, basically come from a fire season. So weekday master already indicates that very hard to control stuff, very hard to control wealth. So um, if too many stress is coming up, yeah, then uh, the sink metal cannot handle it. Okay, the day master can handle it. So we use in barter for a month reading, we actually use it as a terms to say that uh, this is you, this is uh, people around. This is the residents. Uh, this is the, the people that is going through what kind of luck uh, in this particular month. Yeah, so stress and everything is going to build up. Um, and we're having IR, there's been too many things to think of. Too many things to think of, yeah. Having IR. Um, and that will actually cause a lot of stress. Yeah. Um, just mean in normal way of battle reading, it also tells that there's no wealth, no promotions, no race, nothing new. Okay. And it's only good to do uh, improvement, self-improvement in somehow. 
Okay, uh, reflections mark. A very good reflections mark. Okay, there's a normal way of reading the, that particular chart. Okay, very normal way of reading it. Yeah, but there's something very special with the chart is there is a three combo that's going to happen. Of course, this is not going to help with the chart too. Okay. This is uh this is the three combinations. Okay, so these three combinations will actually uh exert out more wood element in the chart. Okay, exert more wood element in the chart. So wood represent wealth in the chart. Yeah, so then will actually it tells you that if your day master cannot control the wealth, uh, and wealth element is actually all around you. Uh, this will actually cause more uh, stress again that you're unable to control the things you want to control and everything just out of control because the wealth element is unfavorable element in the chart. So it's a way that you actually know that, okay, this is going to be a problematic situation. Okay, very problematic situation. This means uh, money issue might arise. If you have certain of that issue that is already happening right now, um, and is actually giving you a lot of stress, uh, I would suggest you to really, really consider taking uh, some calculated risks before you're moving into the month, before you move in, directly move in. And the transition timing is 6th of uh, July. Okay, be very careful with that. Um, and try, because this actually created by combinations. Okay. Combinations means that this is the things that it brings to you by your friends or maybe um, some people around you with different type of colors and different type of uh, personalities. Maybe it's not even your friends. Maybe it's the strangers. They're trying to sell you something and if you are not in the capabilities to take it, please do not do it. Okay? Because this indicates the combinations being activated in chart. Yeah, combination is actually uh, activated in the chart. And there's something that we don't like to see in that, that month is uh, Taiji Nubuman is appearing with this particular pick. So we say that it's a month of reflections and Taiji Nubuman actually appear and Dragon Virtue actually appear. There's a high indications of if something go negative, it will truly, truly go to the bottom line that breaks you apart. And then this Taiji Nubomen can actually come in. So make sure that you don't fall into that part. Okay, not everybody actually ready for that kind of things. Um, but if you are okay, thing is calculated, I would suggest you to really go ahead because you can learn something out of it. Yeah? Spiritual path, understanding what you have in front of you. Um, the biggest boundaries break. Uh, biggest preconceived ideas breaks come from the worst situations, the most painful situations. And it's actually quite good to have that sometime. Yeah. And even recently, I've been actually looking into all these Facebook Reel, TikToks, and stuff like that. Um, they're now, you know, all this thought leader, okay, actually come out saying that pain is necessary. And I do feel in that way too. So you will actually see really pain in this particular month. Yeah. A real, a real pain. Yeah. Okay. Now, According to this chart, so we say wood element is going to be created, um, this part of the chart. So if you have any of this animal sign together with a rabbit, any of this, any one of this in your chart, um, I actually will tell that you will actually get good uh, path to do creations. Okay, any of these three animal signs. That's mean, uh, is it a pig? Is it a goat? Or is it a rabbit? Right? Because you actually will join in to create the three combo, which is the wood frame. Yeah, that's mean in somehow you have chances to create something this particular month. Straight to the point that you have something to create in this particular month. Um, of course, it's not going to be an easy path because it was not supposed to be a favorable element. But I still recommend you, if you have this three animal sign, um, and you're trying to do something, create business, um, 
create anything related with wood element. Yeah, sometimes you just want something to happen in your life. You want to bring new things to your life. Then you have, should perform this. Okay, should perform this. Perform means that, uh, because it's a combination, means find more people, interact with more people, join in more group. Okay, uh, have fun with them. And unconsciously, if can, make sure that there is something that you want inside the group. Yeah, because rabbit, goat, and also pig, you have three, com uh, three harmony combinations. In the case that people comes around, that unconsciously you created that energy flow to produce a wood element. So there's a new creation, new path that can be created in this particular month for three, this animal sign. Yeah, so joining more people, network more. Uh, if you can, uh, really, really find people that, you know, group of people that actually brings value to you. Either learning something, either finding a mentor, uh, it will be very good for you. Okay? Yeah? Yeah, you can actually make creations. Only these three animal sign. Because they have a high interaction with this. Okay? If you have horse in your chart, uh, this will also be a very good, uh, a very, very good uh, indications for you. Because double uh, the goat actually combined with the horse. Yeah. So this one is a little bit different. Um, if you're looking for partnership, looking for hidden deals for horse. Yeah. Um, this will be a very great month for you to seek that part. Okay. Even though that notes, the way to really use Parser is to understand um, if your chart can make an interactions with the animal sign of the, the energies that are actually present right now. And if you can interact and create something, create an element, and that element is a creation. So when the typing was right, like the month that this actually appearing, that indicates that you have chances to do these creations too. Because you're creating element because of your chart. So it depends on where is it the four pillar actually landed on. You actually use it in different area of your life, different aspect of your life. So when you use it, you can actually interact with that and then you get something out of that. Yeah, that is how that you actually use it. Because uh, it's a gold month. It's very good in that terms. Yeah, for something for you guys to use, yeah? Rather than use something then just read it as good or bad, it's not really that useful to you, okay? So if you have goat as uh, nobleman stars, intelligent star, maybe not intelligent stars, uh, nobleman stars, okay, cannot be sky horse. Uh, this is also a great month. Nobleman actually is a great month for you to find somebody and also related to network, to find mentor, to find help, okay, to find advice. Most likely you get a nobleman stars as a goat, uh, this month, you will actually listen to people more. Okay? You actually will listen to people more and you have to do that. Okay? Uh, it's a great nobleman uh, timing. So, uh, make sure that you actually utilize it. This is also related to uh, the month. Uh, related to the year. Okay? So, what else that interact the most um, in the chart? I think these three particular animal signs have to... So you already take notes of it. Okay, so that you can actually use this in this way. Yeah, this four animal sign. Goat, uh, goat, horse, a rabbit, and also the pig. This four animal sign. If it is in your chart, better use it. And if you also have nobleman in your chart as a goat, uh, you also better use it. Okay. Yeah. Now let's talk about health issue this particular month. Um, last one, fire and water clash. All right. And what do we see actually everywhere? Uh, fire disaster. How many of you saw fire disaster around your, uh, your neighborhood, your Facebook? Number one. It's very dominant. That one is like keep on happening the whole year. 
uh, the whole month, not whole year. Okay, what happening? Fire and water clash, uh, boiling something, something getting smoke. Uh, there's a two indications of that. Um, I already tell you in last month, there is a lot of people who are going to be uh, go to the other side of the world. Um, it also happening. Okay. Yeah. So this one will be a little bit different because that one is like a pure clash. This one still have combinations happening. Okay. So combinations happening is going to create wood element, which is not good for the earth. But if you look into health related problem, um, then we're actually looking into a lot of um, illnesses is going to appear. Yeah. And uh, a lot of immune system problem is going to appear. Um, if you're traveling, make sure you're actually on mass. Yeah, because um, sickness sign is actually quite high. Okay, sickness sign is actually quite high. So you have to be very careful with that part. Uh, while the earth element is too high and there's a water related in here, although there's combinations, but still looking into earth too high is that part of problem. Okay, especially G earth. Yeah, accumulations of uh, earth element and sink matter actually related to immune system. So when the immune system is not rooted, high chances that this is the problem for that. So I'm just using a very simple way of forecast. Yeah, Very, very simple way of forecast to look into health related issues. Um, will it cause death or not? Most likely it will not be. Yeah, most likely it will not be because this is IR. Uh, IR also indicates, uh, in a 10 gods, it actually indicates germs and bacteria. IR actually indicates that. That's why in conceiving, we actually don't like the IR to appear too much in the chart. Okay, yeah. So uh, high chances is sickness, high chances is you are um, complacent, negligence towards whatever the surrounding that you are in. Why? Because earth element also indicates uh, just take it everything in. Okay, receptive with everything. So you then know that, okay, this particular um, earth element indicates that it's a straight away reading. Yeah, so be very careful with that. Um, most likely now you actually also see a lot of COVID happening. COVID is changing, evolving again. Uh, influenza is everywhere. Um, it's actually building up, correct? So I have to be very careful with that part. Yeah, it's actually building up. Yeah. yeah. So don't align. Yeah? The forecast is like that. We only trying to forecast that this might be the alignment of energies happening around you, but you don't jump into like align with it. So have to be very careful with that part. Okay. Um, in terms of People like to talk about businesses. Um, if you are okay with your current situations, there will be a lot of um, wealth energies appearing in the chart. A lot of wealth energies appearing in the chart. Yeah, but it's more subtle way of uh, identifying them. Um, you might be able to find a new path of business or wealth creations if you really go out to network because the pig and the goat combined uh, is actually creating the wood element. Wood element will be all the wealth in the chart. Okay, all the wealth in the chart. Yeah? The combinations, it actually will create a, a lot of wealth in the chart. Uh, that's why it's actually quite good for you to uh, go out. If you really want to find money, you want to find businesses, this is month to align with that. Especially you have all those four animal signs. Okay, for wealth purposes, it's actually quite good. Yeah. So what kind of wealth that actually will relate into that part? Um, you will see yeet wood, because most likely the, the money is here, even though it's looks strong when the combinations happen. Um, but yeet wood still related to um people needs or people relations. Okay, um, it will not be, it will not directly being something that you created by your own, something big. Most likely it's a byproduct. Byproduct means that there is something is happening with the market. 
and you need something to support that particular products or main products. Okay, try to look for that part. Yeah, try to look for that part means that you try to look for the sub products that is supporting the main products, main wealth energies, main wealth making uh, in that particular month. Um, if you go into that part, you might find a money creation path. Yeah, because it would <clears throat> can only survive by the tree. The tree is appearing in a chart. Yeah, the biggest money is not the direct wealth. The biggest money is the indirect wealth. Correct? For investment, for businesses, for entrepreneurs, uh, that is a part of it. So find something that is you're creating a product that is supporting the byproduct. Okay, of course, people need, people desire, people solutions for others is, is a, something that you have to look into. Okay? But don't look for it to create yourself. Look into certain product already exists in the market. And then you try to ride on their things by creating a sub product to support that. Okay, that one depends on your business mind. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> now, now let's look into the treatment uh chart. Okay. Um okay, one last thing about this butter chart. <laughs> because we still need to understand if you are in chaos, what you need to do. All right, in chaos, what you need to do. So looking into the chart, you will see there's a lot of earth element. Um, <clears throat> and you can say it's lacking of fire element in this particular uh, chart. Yeah, lacking of fire. Is it lacking of fire? Yeah, lacking of fire. But earth element is too high. You cannot use fire to support earth anymore. And our sink matter here is actually um, <clears throat> a weekday master. Yeah, our sea matter is actually a weekday master. And you can't say very weak, but because the earth element here, and we cannot enhance the earth anymore. We can only enhance the matter element in the chart. Okay, matter element in the chart. Yeah? So um, if we talk about emotionals or emotional problem or mental illnesses, this particular month is less communication. Less communications, yeah. Uh, disconnect, better word. Disconnect with yourself, disconnect with your friend. That will be the biggest issue. So the useful God is to uh, build up your particular confidence level. Uh, if you are doing your businesses, something went wrong, remember your own branding. Very important, yeah? Your own branding, this particular month, if something went wrong, you cannot control. You're out of control. This useful God usage. So the useful God is actually another sing method. Okay, sing method indicates that it is related to uh, communications, uh, related to talking, related to uh, personal branding, because it's beautiful, have to go through personal branding. Okay, friend style also is personal branding. Um, if you do not know what to do right now with you, because we're using the useful God, uh, you might want to use the um referrals to others. That means that if you unable to solve these situations, sometimes don't try to do it yourself, but try to understand, um, observe how other parties actually performing that part. And you actually follow the full step on how other people solve the problem. Friends are actually indicates the way to use it is like that. Okay, refers to others, refer others methods. Yeah, if you're in chaos, because you need to align the chart, balance the chart. Yeah, so if you look into that, then you actually look into that part. And the metal element will cut wood. Of course, fire is not present in the chart, but fire is just too, uh, the, the earth is too high. We cannot put fire anymore. Okay, fire is so high, we cannot put fire anymore. So it's necessary to actually perform that part. Yeah, so friends are personal branding. If you're in chaos, remember who you are. Do your own confidence. If too many problems is happening around you, you are too stressed, also remember who you truly are. Because your confidence will overcome the entire situation. You want to balance the chart. 
Okay? Look back into your confidence level. Look at into what you can do, what you can perform, what is the necessary steps right now that you can actually do. Forget about other things. We are friends size with it to that. So if you don't know, then try to find somebody to communicate. Okay, we're seeing method was meant to do that part. Okay, meant to do that part, yeah. Now, oops. Any questions, please? Everybody okay with this? Okay. Okay. Now, uh, achievement chart. So, most likely in achievement, uh, because of what happened in battle chart. Um, first of all, we actually talk about there is maybe some sickness. Is it that? Is that? Is it that bad? Uh, looks like it. What kind of sickness that you get? This is all related to water element. Okay, so uh, like I say, all the COVID 19 and all the influenza, uh, high chances that the sickness will actually indicate that part. High chances because water was there. Uh, fever is one of the things. Okay, remember this one has disaster shot. It's part of three killing. So uh, you get a gun with snake. High chances there also natural disaster happening, like I said early on. Okay, about money, I say money is actually quite good, um, because there's all, all these indications happening. Um, when you look at here, oh no, Chimen say it is not that easy to go into that part. Okay, if you want to do it, you have to be uh looking into some really crazy changing environment. Okay, fast changing environment, rapid changing environment. Uh, you basically have to go into that part. Now, what kind of byproduct you should look into? Uh, byproduct, rainwater and GF uh, is the what we call the stem related to an actual products that is actually having in the market. Yeah, so uh, rainwater can indicate a lot of things, water related, uh, drinking related. Uh, wine related, maybe it's not supporting the environment. Okay, uh, clothes, refrigerator, everything like that. Food, somehow, food industry is uh, a, a big portion of it, but of course, this is not related to you, yeah. But you still need to do something related to your own, even the chart indicates that. Okay, so for me, I would say, uh, that will be some sort of forecast for you so that you can actually align with that. Yeah, so if you are in water this particular month, um, you're going to be in DE. Okay, we are in water day, master. You're going to be DE. Uh, some changes is going to happen. Expect changes. Try to move around. Try to be more aggressive. Yeah, because it is not uh, environment will force you to become aggressive. Okay, remember that. Yeah? If you are in water, straight to the point. Okay, now. So um, why is it rainwater will get that influence? Yeah? Some of you guys may be asking that. Why is it that? Why is that this actually related to your part chart? Because according to your chart, um, you are actually being influenced by this element inside you. Not just this element inside you. If your whole chart is full of this element, it will also influence you a lot. Okay? Because that element get influenced. Yeah? So that's how I actually use the chart. Okay, now, so um, what else I talk about here? Um, mental illnesses. Is it going to be obvious? Um, you got envoy door, so this part maybe not that much. You will feel stress, but you're still under control. Okay, you will feel stress. You actually will be still be under control. Chances is there. But uh, most likely still under control. There will be a weakness that you're looking into of yourself. Something is already happening. Yeah. But you got pink fire here, got a little bit to repair in. So it's okay not to be uh, too worried about that. Okay. And then what else I talk about in the chart? Uh, networking, is it good? Uh, looks like it's pretty good. Okay. Because you go for networking with the six harmony. Looks like pretty good. Of course, this one, maybe a little bit gossiping, maybe a little bit problem is going to happen with uh, somebody relentlessly try to gossip about you, some backstabbing happening. Uh, but overall, looking into this chart, 
I would say uh, these actions is a good thing to perform. So double up for networking for finding wealth. Okay, double up. And of course, we also need to know that what is people needed, right? Just now we're talking about the uh, the part that I say that if you want to find a byproduct, you also need to know what people actually need. All right. So people um, to develop and to understand what people truly need, you actually you need to use black tortoise. One way is black tortoise, the other way is scenery dollars to use. Yeah, but scenery dog looks like pretty bad. Um, okay, combinations, yeah, combination. When you look at this, we say food. We look at this, we say disaster. We look at this, looks like um, food industry is going to be good if going through for disaster type, supporting that part of. Uh, sometimes you are selling disaster kit. Somehow it can be, yeah? because this kind of uh, indication is actually quite good. Now, this is narrowed down, but it's very hard to narrow down. Okay, I'm just telling you because the combinations of reading. Okay, so looking into this, um, this one, if you want to understand the market and people needs, uh, what is the people true desire? Mm, normally, this related to family matters. Okay, um, family matters, this one related to money management. If money is an issue, most likely this will actually appear. Okay, so what else I talk about in butter in the chart? Um, anything specific you guys want to ask about the money chart? Yeah, so if you are seeing metal this particular month, what you need to do? Go out and network, hunt for networking. Yeah, this one also related to your destiny chart um, in the north. Yeah, so everything here actually can use either your master chart, your destiny chart, actually both ways the same. This one influences you the most. Okay, this one is your, your subconscious mind. This particular month is actually go out to network. Luckily, this is my my this is actually my uh destiny palace. I actually going out for some event. Luckily for that. Okay, so this is actually good. Uh relationship. Somebody went to last that, right? Hmm. What about being fired? Yes, we'll go through that, yeah. So if you are being fired, day master, um is this here the, the graveyard? No, okay, it's not the graveyard in here. So this one is actually quite good for learning something. Okay, if you're looking about into businesses and stuff like that, uh, details, uh, strategic planning for a company. Okay, strategic planning for a company, if you're being fired, you should actually do perform that. Uh, this boss is actually quite good, but there is a door compare. Okay, it's a very big door compound. Uh, normally indicates that you need to dig up something, be very aggressive with what you're planning. Um, you maybe want to find new boundaries to break in, new market to go into, but it's all step by step details planning to look into your company future if you're looking for wealth. Yeah, okay. If you're in your personal life, most likely what's going to happen to you, uh. <clears throat> This is the month that a lot of secret actually un, un, unblock. Okay, most likely unblock, yeah? Okay. Uh, jump with DM, normally we don't forecast that, but you still fall under the chief. Yeah, so you have a chief in here. Uh, the jump, we're actually in present. Um, in Chiman, is actually kind of hard to use the jump, but it's okay. You can still perform that. Okay, so we see Wu Earth, Sing Metal, uh, most likely related to some money related things is going to happen. Um, if you want to sell something, you want to break some wealth, is the right month to do so. <clears throat> okay, it's the right month to do so. Yeah, if you want to break some wealth, um, is <clears throat> is a big indications of wealth breaking. When Jack meet with Wu, Jack with me, seeing there's some sort of problem actually with ongoing, and you see a death door in present, that means something is going to stop. Okay, 
Yeah, she was saying one to one consider network or mass a uh, mass event. Um, I would say one to one is also good, but according to the chart, since the three combo is happening, better to go for more than two or three person. Doing fixated in the net, yeah. <clears throat> okay. If you are Wu Day Master. Most of the time this month, you got leadership related um, issues. Okay. Most of the time, you have uh, leadership related issues. Uh, this is because that uh, Wu and Jia are not supposed to be together. So there's an opposing element. The leader, maybe your boss, maybe is going to suppress you a little bit uh, because that kind of problem is happening. Okay. The Wu Day Master. Yeah. So uh, this is how that it actually indicates that. So of course, according to Wu Earth in Chi Men Cha, we actually look at it as the cash capital. Yeah, so we go in cash and capital Wu Earth, that really indicates that there will be some sort of uh, cash related issue is going to happen. So you have to be very careful this month if cash problem. So there's two of them related to uh, uncontrollable wealth in part. In Chimen also indicates that there is some sort of wealth breaking is happening. Yeah. Okay. So that you have to be very careful with this part uh, in whatever that you're doing next month. Okay. If that is the problem. If it's not a problem, ignore what I say. Okay. Because the chart only can align with, cannot be in somehow, uh, it actually cannot be like a, um, how to say, it? it cannot be an actual event that is going to happen to you unless it happens to you. Okay, so that you actually be very careful with that part. Yeah. <clears throat> Do you have relations to Pate and Chimen Chan? Uh, actually, yes. Both of them actually indicate the same thing. Yeah. Now, if you look into Goi Water now, there's a separation of reading to this. Yeah. Goi is actually the, uh, the EG of the Human chart, Geng is the rock wealth. Okay. Actually, you have to look, look into that way. Eh? I'm just using a simple way so that I can separate the reading of these particular things happening to the person. Yeah. If you have Geng, you will have different interactions with Ren water. If you have Kui, you also have different interactions with Ren. But if you are Geng metal, you see Ren and Kui together. Most likely this month, if you are Kung Mata, yeah, the day master, most of the time this month related to a lot of um, true self-reflections is going to happen. Most of the time. Okay, if you don't reflect, you don't understand where you are, this indicates a trap. Yeah, so if anything problem is going to happen with a Kung, you have to be very careful that this trap is going to stay very long time until you realize that it was a trap, okay? What kind of trap that you're actually looking into? Uh, maybe past problem, or maybe something that you lie to yourself, okay? Green with surging snake, if you're looking into a day master reading, uh, not disaster reading, uh, it actually related to a lot of past, not past, a lot of problem that is accumulating. So this palace is actually not a good palace. Not a good palace. And this palace is actually not a very good palace. Yeah. So if you have Kui and Keng, most of the time, this is a problem that will appear. So for Keng metal, highly related to competitors or wrong motivations a problem. Okay, for Gui Water, most likely your problem is uh, you are not willing to let go uh, certain ideas that you have or certain dreams that you have. That all along, it was already creating a problem. So Geng and Gui, this is the things that you should look forward into. Yeah, so if a problem, then try to solve it, try to do self-reflections. Your human actions is very important. Uh, your decisions making is very important. So I'm just giving you awareness if it's happening in that way, remember what you hear in here. Okay? Remember that. So that you can actually do some uh, thoughts about what is happening so that you can make better decisions. Yeah? If you are 
Um, just now somebody is actually talking about GF, a G Day Master. Um, this box, um, actually is a kind of a, a good box to have, even though you've got fear doors, and fear doors is actually on envoy doors. So most likely you got a GF this particular month. Um, it's better to you to do because it's also related to IR. Yeah. If your GF is actually really planning for what ahead of you in a future path. Because I have actually related to futures. Yeah. If it's not, um, then it's time to slowly um shape yourself to be somebody as good as possible. Okay, it's either your skill, your talents, uh, whatever that you're executing, your mindset, your strategy, it's time to show slowly shape it, slowly compress it until a step-by-step -step structures that can come up. Because you have a heavenly heart with here and also with being fired. Okay, this one is actually very good for that too. To be uh to be executed. Okay, looking for what this will bring you in future value. If you are GF. Yeah, since you actually can you get good a box here, actually influence you in that way. Okay, so they can actually perform that part. Yeah. Now thing fire in here, uh, this one actually got what we call thing go into Gui and thing meet with Keng. Um, uh, this particular month, you will be working too much, sacrificial. Okay, you will be exhausting yourself a lot. Um, maybe you're very hard to see your goal. Maybe you make wrong decisions to go into some drama. Or maybe you actually, because of fighting with somebody, okay, fighting with somebody, put yourself in, in disadvantage. Yeah, so most of the time when we see uh, the problematic Geng and Gui, we actually try to remove these two elements from your uh, your way of performing this particular month. So Gui water indicates as, maybe you think too much, maybe you care too, uh, too much of things, maybe you're trying to end something, Right, so stop the emotions happening. Gung metals maybe indicates that you overly take uh, responsibility of something. Okay, your executions go overheat your your capabilities. So if you're thinking fire in your chart, uh, this will tell you directly that maybe this will actually uh, be overbearing to you. Yeah, very overbearing to you, and it's cause problem. Okay, but when you see open door you actually have chances to get promotions. Yeah, so it's either you want to take it or you don't want to take it. It depends on you. Yeah, if your, your destiny palace in here, uh, promotions maybe is something going to happen. If it doesn't have, try to align yourself with it. Yeah, but I'm going to directly tell you, you're going to be a very exhausting month. Everything is changing. Everything is happening in here. Right? Maybe it's because of promotions, you will get exhausted yourself. Okay? Yeah, so because of that, you better try to uh, relinquish unnecessary dots. If responsibility is not really that necessary to you, try not to take it. Yeah, but because of promotions or raise, then no choice, you have to go and perform it. Yeah, so remember that when you once you take it, that part, this whole month, it's going to be exhausting. Yeah. Okay. Now, Yid Wood. So in here, Yid Wood, we met with uh, Wolf. Uh, this Yid actually, I would say it's actually kind of good uh, box, but you got a uh, black tortoise in present. Okay. So Yid meet with Wu. Uh, this is actually a good related um, responsibility that you're going to take too, but this one is a little bit different. Uh, you somehow see something that you can actually chase for it. Okay. But remember, you have got black tortoise. Please try not to, uh, how to say, it? you got black tortoise indicates that you might um, think in a very different way of whatever that you're trying to achieve. 
Yeah, different means that you might like to yourself, you might forget the important things, you might go into shortcut to do the things that you need to do, you might get uh, because of laziness, you don't want to do more. You actually go into that part. Well, black thought is actually uh, in, in that sense, is that kind of way of uh, reading. Yeah, but if I were you looking into this, that means there's a chances for you to find money. Uh, make sure that your goals is consistent. Uh, because of rest door, rest door actually you can use it in different way. Um, use it in a way that is bringing people to run things for you. Utilize your friends, right? Try not to scam your friends, your family, because your black tortoise is here. Yeah, so that you can actually use this as a performing uh, way. Yeah, uh, of course, if you singular look into black tortoise box, you're actually looking into uh, the possible scamming that is going to happen this particular month. Yeah, there's something like this you have to be aware too, right? So be careful with banks calling you. Be careful with maybe somebody pretending to be your family members. Be very careful with that because uh, chances this is going to happen. High chances this is going to happen because the tortoise is here. Okay? Yeah? Now, everybody good? Any questions? Any questions? Uh, we must say, do you look into oxygen in the man chart? Uh, depends. Okay? Sometimes to, to look into that. Okay? Travel to avoid? Mm. Um, if the place is prone to disaster, I would advise you not to do it. Okay, the only problem in this chart is disaster. Um, kind of obvious is going to happen. Okay, yeah, maybe another volcano erupt. Maybe I'm not really sure, but looking into that, there's a chances of that happening. Okay, there's a chances of that happening because Kung in East. Is represent thunder. Thunder actually also indicates an abrupt changes. So anything that can erupt is either earthquake or um, a volcano erupting. So when you look into green with scenery doors, uh, it also has chances that something is pouring out from the land. Okay, so that is a combination of volcano erupting. But I'm not really sure it's going to happen or not. Okay, Victoria form is there. Yeah, the way to look at Victoria form is there. Yeah, so not really a problem to travel, but very be, be very careful with uh, the all these influenza things that's going to happen. Okay, any more questions with this? This is like really free, really free stars. Really, really free stars. Eh? I never thought that one hour actually can finish this. Any problem? Anything you guys want to ask? How can someone pretend to be family? We got, uh, right now we got AI, have somebody actually recorded the voice, changed the voice to be somebody you know, and then they actually use a phone number to call you too. Use the same number to call you and ask you for, you know, I'm in some problem. Can you borrow me some money uh, to do banking and something like that happen? It's, all, it's already happening right now. All right. So be very careful that that might coming up uh, for alignment. Okay. Last month, um, what if a person with same way Fuyin effect is uh, double. Um, man, most likely will not cause that big problem, but it will do. It will actually good. It's actually good man for you to reflect on what happening in this particular month, so that you can use it next. Means that if next luck pillar is appearing, uh. This particular month, because double of this element come up, high chances that you will met with that issue, but it's not going not going to be very big. Not going to be very big. 
But it's good to take note because the same energy will be reflected on luck pillar or the year ahead. Yeah? That is a way of uh, recognizing energies so that you know that, okay, this one, you know, this kind of shit is going to happen. So be prepared that in that luck pillar is also will be in that way. Okay? If being fire and destiny present, so I look both in North, East and North. Yes, Jane. Yeah? So if you're using your destiny palace, means that your decisions making skill this month for achievement later chart is related to that particular influence. This means that if you're in North, high chances that you would like to go out and influencing you the way to accept uh, networking and talking with people, right? If your day master is a bing fire, that's most likely that uh, the chances of opportunity that happening is related to your being fire in the uh, Chiman chart. So different different way of looking to that. Yeah, one more of opportunity, one more into decisions making. Okay. If their master is woof, but later palace show thing and small wood next to it, which stand should I look into? Um, both of them, same box. Okay. Um, okay. Um, I think Regina, you are still quite confused with that, right? So it indicates that your day master is Wu, you are Wu. It is not thing. It is Wu. Okay. Because it's already shown you that you are a Wu. Thing fire in there is only a calculation that is really like that. Okay, but you're looking for formations, then we will actually plus with thing. Okay. Okay, let's talk about this. Something very interesting I talked about last uh last month. Okay, I say that the fire and water clash actually will indicate that is a chances to become famous, and then we look into uh look into the flying stars. I also said that there is a very big chance for somebody to become famous. So if you are in Malaysia, uh, do you come by with the name <laughs> one by one? <laughs> Singapore, Malaysia, I think you actually noticed that. Anybody notice that? The one by one stuff? And nobody actually noticed that, yeah? <laughs> yes. The gentleman, do you know that the guy actually now is an influencer? Is going all the way around their place, introducing the food around that place? Do you know that? Yeah. So, <laughs> Alim say yeah. Vicky said no. Okay, now that Indian guy actually going around introducing food, you know? They already become an influencer. Okay, then the another one, uh, this one is actually quite famous. Anybody notice there is a girl keep on appearing in your Facebook or not? And people make, actually do remix. It seems like the gentleman actually they do all the poster stuff and stuff like that. Not Adeline, uh, Adeline? is it Adeline? I'm actually not sure. Is it Adeline? Is it the name? I only know the hard tools of or hard tour things. Okay. And I don't know you guys from you know other places and stuff like that. Uh, anybody actually get famous suddenly? Eh? <laughs> Jane said both you don't know. <laughs> they are famous because of the wrong thing. Okay, Jim, you have to uh, find uh, <laughs> they are famous because of the wrong thing. This is uh, hot and then it's tour. Okay, then the other one is uh... <laughs> okay, and then the other one is uh, uh, the gentleman. So I'm not sure your place who actually get famous, yeah, but this particular girl is the most uh, famous one. So this girl also take the chances to not only everybody like 
know how to, what to do. Yeah? Once that you get famous in whatever it is, you need to start to do selling. You know that? Yeah, it's like there's some sort of like an advisor behind the scene. Oh, this guy is going to be famous. <clears throat> Let's ask this person sell something, you know, do influencer. Okay. Last one was very interesting because I was talking about that. And then suddenly there is already a gentleman fighting. <laughs> okay. I was like, okay. And then we saw the the the, the hat tour things is actually gone viral. You guys should search for that. Of course, it's going to sabo your your Facebook for a moment. Yeah, because it will keep on coming out after that. <laughs> okay. So this month, um, we got goat. Goat is actually in here. This is goat. And then we have rabbit. And then we have this, uh, <clears throat> the pig in here. So the month energy is this. Okay, this is the month energies. Now when you look at that, um, of course, there is a chances of uh, public speaking too, but not as famous as the last month. Because last one is number two, right? I think number two and seven actually appearing. Okay. This one have some sort of authorities happening. Okay. Uh, race, getting promotions. If you are really this particular month and you feel like you have chances to get promoted, uh, please do so. Please go and apply. Don't care about your who is your superior. Don't care about who is that person who doesn't care about that. If you think that you are actually getting a, a path of promotions or maybe get a higher paying job, actually you can actually get it. Because energy was aligned. <clears throat> in this particular month. Okay, energy was aligned in this particular month. So there's a high chances for you to apply for that. Remember, it's going to be very stressful because in Chiman Chai, it indicates that. But the chances is that opportunity is there. So just do the energy exchange to go into moving to that part if you want. Okay, if you want, yeah. Because the authority is actually in present. Star 6 is in present. Yeah, Star 6 is actually in present. So it's actually a quite a good thing to go into that. Okay, quite a good thing to go into that. So then you got star one in present. Uh, remember this nine and six actually really can do uh, promotions and also asking for raise and something like that can happen. Uh, if you want this one, you should really perform it. Yeah. Okay, uh, star one here indicates a mentor. Um, maybe new business venture, okay, support by Nobleman, okay, actually it's quite good for that. So um, somehow these two indicate authority figures, these two, there's a combination between happening with these two, um, indicate authority figure if you want. This is actually quite good to, uh, if you are in the, directions to get certified for something to become to being recognized by something this is also a month to do it okay <clears throat> yeah so that you can actually get this uh you know you can actually apply for uh educators uh of the years you know uh get the titles of the years get the 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 name that you're supposed to own Okay, or you can also name yourself like that. You can actually do, do that, yeah? Because it's actually quite good in that way to allow people to recognize your, your authorities and also your expertise in something. Because one six is actually in present. Yeah, so that you, uh, this is actually high level. Uh, high chances of happening. So if you have chances, is appear in front of you. Somebody asks you to apply for that. Take it. Okay? Take it. Uh. Don't, don't try to deny it. Because denying it, you're actually rejecting luck. Yeah? If you want to want, find, want to find money, then this is the way to do it. Yeah? If you want find the money, this is the way to do it. Getting title, getting status is actually good for your uh, criteria and stuff like that. It's actually quite good. Okay? Uh, seven in here is still talking about influencing and public speaking and stuff like that. Um, 
it was still ongoing this month, uh, but it's not really like good in like last month. This month is actually just for you to build up your status more into that part. Okay, now, so then we have to understand also when you look at this, um, is your sun chi is here. Okay, your life generating is here or your full way sector is here. Then chances for you to raise promotion is there. Okay. Uh, sun chi in here also very good. Yeah. Um, if your ten yi sectors in here is actually very good. Ten yi means the heavenly doctor in the northwest is actually very good. I'm not sure which one. I can't remember the calculations, but look it on yourself. Yeah. Okay. Um. Then if you have a uh, liu sha at here, it's actually very good. Six killing. Six killing in here, very good. Yen Nen sectors in here, also very good. Okay. Yeah. Then you actually have a good place to be in. Yeah. So this month, uh, <clears throat> activation sectors, um, because this is a, a main criteria, right? This one is actually quite good. Um, this one producing out, this one not really good. This one, seven, not really good. <laughs> okay. Uh, the nine in the middle cannot use. One in here. Uh, Northwest is actually quite a good place to do activations. Yeah. Northwest good for activations. Um, Dragon Virtue in present. So this one is actually quite a good uh, place for activations. So what you need to do, just pick a good success day and then do a water activation. Don't care the stars. Just pick a good success day. You want to boost, got a good success day. So Northwest is actually quite a good sectors to activate. Okay. Especially in the pick sectors. Especially, well, this one is a dragon virtue. Okay, so if you want to do water activation is kind of good. Yeah, water activations will be very good in here. So you can do a water activations. Uh, generally, it's already good. So if you are good in date selections, you can actually narrow down it to be even better. Okay, for some of you guys, yeah. And some of you guys in the, my annual, I already give you the date. You can actually perform that. I think you got one or two dates, only one date only in that place. Okay, you can actually do a water activations in here, which is quite a good uh, activations for you. Okay, so what else? What else do we have to look at? Nothing else, we have to look at it. Anybody got any questions? Anything you want specifically for you? Anyone? Actually, the hard tour thing is <laughs> really amazing. Yeah? They have uh, all sorts of remakes. Uh... <laughs> Jay was saying you saw it on YouTube. That's good. <laughs> A lot of things, you know. I think uh, I think got video games. Is it got video games? <laughs> got video games. Uh, all sorts of things. Very daring, yeah? But now he, the, the girl is actually selling something. Selling the cat. Okay. Once that you search for it, your Facebook will full of it. Facebook, YouTube will full, right? It will come up. Keep on come up. Okay. That's why I was laughing. Famous, unconsciously famous for stuff, yeah? A uh, good sector to heal. Um... Normally, we will use the star six as the way of healing. Normally, yeah. Normally, we use the star six. Yeah, some ways is actually quite good uh, for energy healing. But um, this particular month, actually, you can do activation in here. Okay. This year, activations cannot use metal. You better go and buy a, a, a god. Good, I don't know what the uh, wulong very easy. 
Wulo is very easy. So you can actually use Wulo for uh, activations. Okay, pick a good remove day. Yeah, dry one, not the not the 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 one that can still uh become moldy. Okay. Uh, my destiny is in north. How can I make changes to enter a new industry? By refer not palace, stay away from comfort zone. Um normally if you are in north, you're trying to make into a new industry. Are you already there? Okay. So let me stop this. See, I'm asking questions because I want to uh, upload this in YouTube later on. I will stop this recording. Yeah. So stop.